Hello there, YouTubers. Welcome to the outdoor gear review of the Platypus 3 liter Big Zip hydration bag. This is an excellent hydration system that you may want to consider for your own use. This is a non pressurized hydration system, unlike the uh, Geiger rig, which I may review later on. This is $32 on Amazon, and the price is very comparable to other hydration systems out there on the market. One aspect to the platypus hydration bladder that makes it so special is the wide zip mouth. If you have small hands, you're able to stick your hand actually inside of this and you could dry it out and clean it out if you want to. Um, my hands don't fit quite in this, but still, this wide mouth makes it really simple to fill it up with water. Um, you could add ice to your bag on a hot day or easy, even um, for putting Gatorade in there if you wanted to do that. Securing your water in your bladder after you filled it up is extremely simple thanks to this wide mouth zipping uh, locking system. Basically it's just like a, a Ziploc bag. You can smash it shut, shut here and then zip it and lock. Very, very simple, and it's ex extremely secure. I've never had this bag leak. Also, this works a heck of a lot better than, say, the uh, screw-on lid type variety of hydration bags. Um, I I've had trouble with those in the past, leaking around the rims, um, and in this case, I mean, it really is fantastic. This hydration bag is extremely durable. I've had this bladder roughly two years and I've used this on literally hundreds of miles of hiking, hundreds of miles of mountain biking, um, lots of kayaking as well. I've never had one issue with this bag. It does offer what Platypus calls uh, quick connects. You could just Pop that off right there, nice and simple. Um, it doesn't leak when you do this, just a little bit of water that's in between the tube and the connector, but no big deal. Very simple. Very simple and easy to replace the hose if you had to. With this Platypus bag, Platypus does offer an insulated hydration pack. Um, it's available for about $44 and fits this model perfectly. Um, it, it protects your bag, your system from freezing uh, during the colder months. Um, just a couple days ago, I took this bag out on a 34 mile uh, day hike and the temperatures got down to about 14 degrees. Um, within a couple hours of starting my hike, the entire tube froze solid straight into my backpack. Um, luckily enough, I had some extra water in a Nalgene bottle that didn't freeze. But uh, it took a couple hours for this to thaw out once the temperatures got into the 40s. So uh, that's a system that you may want to consider purchasing if you're doing some winter hiking. Uh, definitely if the temperatures are going to be below 20 degrees, I highly recommend that you get the uh, insulator. The bite valve, very, very good. Uh, no issues with flow. Um, definitely works just as good as others, if not better. This platypus bladder is compatible with the uh, Gravity Works filtration system if you ever want to hook up some sort of water filter. Um, there's other uh, solutions available for this as well, but uh, Platypus does make their own Gravity Works system. When it comes to purchasing one of these bladders, I always recommend that you wash them and clean them thoroughly just to remove all the excess chemicals from the manufacturing process. Um, compared to other bags, this is super simple. Um, I mean, you do have the wide mouth zip there, it makes it really easy to get inside and clean these. But, uh, you know, I, I have some Camelback uh, bladders that still taste like chemicals and plastic after, I don't know, years worth of use, dozens of washings. I use soap and water to clean this one time, and there is no chemical or plastic taste. Um, so, that's a major plus in my book. This bed does fit into the hydration sleeve of 
just about all uh, backpacking systems. I've used this with, I don't know, seven or eight backpacks so far over the years. And of course it's fit every single one. No issues there. Like I said before, highly durable, uh, no leaks, um, no problems, no issues. Um, some freezing in the colder weather, but that's typical of any bladder system that's not insulated. Um, for the outdoor gear review, we rate this extremely high. Um, this is a fantastic piece of kit that you may want to consider for your hydration needs. As stated before, this is a non-pressurized system, so you do have to suck. Um, maybe in the future, I'll show you guys a uh, pressurized system. That uh, all you gotta do, I mean, it actually squirt water if you hold down the, the mouthpiece. But uh, that's for another video. Um, I wanna thank you guys for coming and watching and uh, taking a look at this fantastic bag. If you guys have any questions, please let me know. I'll happily uh, address them for you. Um, everyone, be good to each other, take care, get outdoors.